Hi, welcome back to the Disvow YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the Dose X from Lone Star Discs. This is in the glow plastic. The numbers are 84 negative 1, 2. Since it's in the glow plastic, it's going to be a little bit more overstable because I'm pretty sure the glow is the most overstable plastic. Maybe it's the founders. I'm not quite sure about that. Um, but anyways, I'm just going to throw in the field on different angles. I hope you guys are able to see it well. It's not the best color right now. It's pretty windy. The wind's blowing right at me, um, but it should be stable enough not to have the wind affect it too much. All right, we're going to start with the hyzer. First go of the day here. Maybe a little flip up. Other than that, just held it the whole way. I didn't throw it super hard, so. All right, now I'm going to throw the Anheuser. I'm not particularly good at those lately, so hopefully this will go well. I put it on a little Annie. Came right out of it. I'll throw again and put it on more for you guys. Just came right out of it. All right, I would definitely suggest this disc if you're looking for a nice overstable eight speed. Um, I don't know how it flies in the alpha plastic or any other plastic but glow because I only have a glow one, but it should be more understable in the alpha plastic or lima plastic. Um, I'm not quite sure if it'll be more understable in the Bravo one. It, sh it should be, this should be the most overstable plastic you can get the Dosex in. So if you're looking for an eight speed that's really overstable, Definitely check out the Glow Dose X. If you're looking for a straighter Dose X, go down to like the Alpha Plastic. And if you're looking for a flippy one, Lima, definitely check it out from Lone Star. It feels really good in my hand. This one has a nice dome to it. And just fits in my small hands really well. And remember, throw like a girl. 